I'm Judy Lowe. I'm the Global Coordinator for Forest and Other Wild Plant Resources at Bioversity International. We were part of a large collaborative project that involved national partners from eight different countries, including Cameroon, to develop guidelines to allow them to sustainably manage the species and conserve the species. And here we are on the lower slopes of Mount Cameroon, walking towards Prunus africana trees. Prunus africana is called African cherry, and it's related to other cherry species. But for this cherry species, it's not the cherries that it's important for, it's the bark. The bark is important for a number of pharmaceutical products that are important in treating prostate disorders. People in this area had depended on the harvest of the bark for income. Um, there is a high level of poverty in this area and um, it's quite important to them to have this source of income. There has been over-harvest of the bark, which has resulted in decline of the species, and it has been listed on CITES Annex 2, which means that countries have to prove that they are sustainably managing the species before bark can be shipped or sold in the international market. The people who led us to this tree are part of a farmer's organization. They have developed sustainable harvesting practices and um, they are very interested in maintaining a sustainable harvest. But because of the ban on imports into the EU as a result of the CITES listing, they are no longer able to sell any of their products. This is uh, an example of the, the bark, how it looks when it's sliced off the tree. If the bark is removed all the way around the tree, that girdles the tree, the tree will die. But bark can be removed from two sides of the tree at once, every five to seven years, in a sustainable way. This machine had not been used for some time before we visited the community because of the ban on exports, but they were demonstrating to us how it works. We're hoping that as a result of our work, they will be able once again to sustainably harvest the bark and improve their incomes.